I'm Molly from Bonsai Direct and in this video I'm going to show you one of our repotting kits and show you how to repot a bonsai into this pot. We have a big range of bonsai pots on our website so you will definitely be able to find one that fits your bonsai pot. I'll show you what comes in your bonsai kit. So you should have everything you need. It comes with a bag of soil, some wire to tie your bonsai in nicely, some bonsai mesh for holes, chopstick and a repotting guide. So I'm going to start with taking the bonsai carefully out of its pot. And I'm going to use the chopstick to pick off some of the soil around the edges. So you can start to see the roots are coming a bit looser. Make sure you do it underneath as well. If you tease around the bottom of the trunk, you may actually find some more roots. Now these are really nice and later on you'll use a toothbrush and try and expose them a little bit more. So once you've teased out around the edges and underneath, you can cut any really long straggly bits off. And then we get to the pot. So with your bit of bonsai wire. Take these up through the bottom of the holes. Get your two pieces of mesh. Like so, this will stop any soil from coming out the bottom of the holes. Open your bag of soil. Just put a little layer on the bottom so the roots underneath can grow. You may need a little bit more underneath, depends on how thick the root ball is. Just going to tighten the wire. Ideally, you want the top of the tree to stand upright and the bottom of the trunk be more central. And then use your chopstick to work in some of the soil around the root ball.
starting to feel quite tight in the pot now. And maybe first one to get some scissors to cut the wire down a bit. And we use the oil to top dress it now. If you want to, you can then give the bottom of the trunk any tree roots you found, a little bit of a scrub. And there we go. The bonsai repotted into its lovely new pot. As you can see, this bonsai looks so much better in its new pot. And the roots now have a chance to grow into the new soil, which is a mix of compost and akadama. I chose this pot because the oval shape really helps bring out the ed elegance of the tree. The colour also really helps the bright green leaves stand out. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you need to know how to work out what bonsai pot you need for your tree, then we will do a video of that at some point. Right, thank you very much for watching.